Today I'm going to share my best tips for visiting Cadiz, where I used to live and I've visited many times. My first tip is to visit the Cadiz Cathedral. The cathedral took over 130 years to build. It is absolutely massive. The plaza in front of it actually looks a little bit small, so it's kind of like you walk to this plaza and then all of a sudden you see this giant cathedral. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's known for its yellow tiled dome and there are 16 chapels within the cathedral. So I highly recommend that when you visit Cadiz, you go inside the cathedral because you can see the crypt. Next, I recommend that you visit one of the watchtowers. There are hun over a hundred watchtowers in Cadiz and the Torre Tavira is one that you can go inside. Next, visit the beaches. There are many, many beaches in Cadiz. So Plaza Victoria, La Caleta, uh, Santa Maria del Mar are a few of my favorites. Uh, so I definitely recommend that you bring a towel, bring a beach chair, and enjoy some of the gorgeous beaches in Cadiz. At least spend one day or a half a day at the beach in addition to exploring the city. La Caleta is probably the most famous. That's the one that's in the old downtown section. Um, it's surrounded by two castles. There's lots of fishing boats, so it's very beautiful. Next, I recommend that you visit the plazas. In the old part of town, there are beautiful plazas that are surrounded by cathedrals and parks. So make sure that you walk through the city and discover all of them. Um, next, I recommend that you walk along the boardwalk, the paseo, and then of course you have to eat the food. There's so much good food in Cadiz, whether it's um, gazpacho or paella, um, churros, there's so many good delicious things to eat. So make sure that you pop in and have some tapas and enjoy everything that the city has. Finally, just get lost. The old town has tons of streets that can be quite narrow and winding. Put your map aside and just wander and you're sure to find something. For all my tips, check out the blog. Thank you.